Good to see you again. How is your Pokedex coming along? Oh no, it looks like almost all of your Pokémon have died. You still have lots to do. Try getting good. Welcome back. We survived. We got a bird and we got a crab. I love survived is the right word. <laughs> we are we are on our last breath right now. No. We desperately need to catch a couple more solid Pokemon that also happen to be perfect typing to deal with this gem that we're stuck on. Oh yeah, I forgot to put these the dead guys away. Now is the gym technically the next spot or are we able to go like a different route to like fight more trainers and shit? Well, there's not really any reason that we would want to fight the trainers. Uh, did Beefy die? Beefy got murdered. What killed Beefy? Um, yeah. fucking Beedrill got killed by fake out. Beefy... I think Beefy got bit to death when he was sleeping uh, and confused. Yeah, he got crit, that's right. I forgot about that. No, we, we got this. Crit, he would wake up. Dude, look at this fucking team. Dude, yeah. <laughs> Krabby and bored. Uh, right. We could catch, like, fucking, one Pokemon? There's, there's a couple Pokemon we could catch, actually, I think. Well, we got one in the city right here. Let's hope that these Pokemon are, are the dream team. Oh, an item that we literally can't use. Nice. Do, do, yeah. do, do. Oh, yes. Boy. The Pokemon we need. Oh, boy. Maybe it'll have... Maybe it'll be holding, like, a Sunstone and we can go all there. He's gonna... Watch him kill Krabby. Oh, my God. You're right. You're 100% right. Yeah, throw the bird out. Rock slide. <laughs> Ah, fuck you. Oh, God. If I crit there. <laughs> no, Frank. That doesn't bode well, though, that if a, a, a Natu's peck almost one-shot that thing. Yeah, but you remember these, uh, these creatures normally come with a sunstone when you catch them. Do they? I hope so. Hell so yeah. Bad Sun Kern. There's not there's no downside to evolving these ones right away. Either, to either is there? I don't think so, not in this system. Oh, whoops, I forgot to. Alright, a sunscurn. Uh, he has an item. Let's uh what you got? Sunstone, yeah. Nice. All let's right. let's read some random facts about Pokemon you catch just to keep it interesting. A sun kern. It lives by drinking only dewdrops from under the leaves of plants. It is said that it eats nothing else. Hmm. Interesting. <laughs> Alright. Everybody's going to level 15. Did it have a sunstone on it? It did, it did. I'm gonna get it to 15 before I evolve it, though. I don't know if there's a reason to not evolve it. Like, there probably is. Like, you get access to a move or something, but... It's usually the case with, like, stone Pokemon. Yeah, Sunflora. Sunflora's in the daytime. It rushes about in a hectic manner, but it comes to a complete stop when the sun sets. It sounds like a lot of people I know. <laughs> sounds up with the lives of a lot of people I do know. Bro, this is gonna be on Krabby and Sunkern to carry this gym, by the I way. No, it was, uh, I thought you said there was a few more opportunities to catch Pokemon. I know, but like, they're probably gonna be the ones that have to actually, like, actively carry the gym. No, oh, God! It's a flower now. Uh, it's got a solid, it's got a lot of health. Raises speed and sunshine. It doesn't know fucking the sunshine move yet. No, it does not. But gr growth is, uh, pretty strong. That's only if we have the opposite. You gotta remember, we gotta sack something to that Geo dude. Um. So that's gonna be a problem on top of it. We need to find a water Pokemon that knows like Hydro Pump and is super quick. 
don't don't know if that's gonna be something we can find very easily. You're right. Dun, dun, dun. We saw the power of a self-destruct on the uh, Pikachu. Yo, yeah. So. At the end of that match, when Ash, Ash, or his name, he's not Ash, Red. When, Red. when Red was speechless, what he was trying to say is, did you kill my fucking Pikachu? <laughs> <laughs> is Pikachu dead? It's like, you sure is. Oh, uh, okay. I mean, you could catch a Magikarp. Yeah. I mean, if we want to sack a potential Gyarados to the... That'd be the only thing we would use it for right now, is to just fucking eat the self-destruct and... <laughs> I mean, why not, right? Yeah, we need all the Pokemon we could get. Not a nibble. That Magikarp knew. <laughs> She's like, I'm not gonna blow up. <laughs> this seems like a trap. <laughs> Oh, oh my shit. god. Shit. The Lord. The I water. Sack him. The water wa rock type coming in clutch. You can't fuck it up, dude. Oh, yeah. False swipe it. Thank you for the bubble gift, my lord. Damn. I, I like how you were like shit talking. He's like, yeah, man. We need to get a Pokemon now, like, fodder. Then here comes Ammonite just from the heavens, like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> I am here to save the run. <laughs> uh, I am I am also a rock type. <laughs> so self-destruct isn't effective against me. Right, maybe one more false sight. I'm kinda scared because he crit with that bubble beam and that did actually a lot of damage. Oh he's just fucking sitting pretty with Oh Rock Tomb's not that bad. That did less damage than his not very effective bubble beam. Throw the best Pokeball you got. Great ball. <laughs> You're just fishing and then you picked up a fossil like, oh my god, oh no. Shit. Uh oh. We got a slot. Get the flower. <laughs> I think Rock Tomb's gonna kill it. No, it's not super nah, effective. It'll be alright. <laughs> right. uh, um, yeah. I don't want to risk it. Get caught, Almanite. God damn it. I imagine this is a very low catch rate on this this thing because it's kind of a not common Pokemon. Alright. Rock and water. He has very high defense and special attack. No. I can't hit it with absorb because it will be 4x and kill yeah, it. Yeah, it'll it'll super kill it. Just fucking get caught, please. We need you. Thank yes. God. Alright. What are you gonna call this on the night? Uh God. Um, the Pokedex says, in prehistoric times, it swam on the sea floor eating plankton. Its fossils are sometimes found. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you feel like you know that Pokemon a little bit more? I do. I'm more attached than ever. I want to. I'm, I'm really interested to see what its ability is. Oh, yeah, that's a good point. Immune to self-destruct. Now, we're able to catch one more Pokemon? Or... I think so. We gotta go to the right outside of the town. I think there's another encounter there. Oh, oh I'm trapped. <laughs> help, help, I am trapped. Kind of I think te technically, if we manage... Watch out, that's a trainer! To... Yeah, there. that's a double battle right there. Between a rock and a flying guy. I think, theoretically, if we manage to get to the other side, we could get another Pokemon from the uh, the cave. But that's a lot of encounters, right? Yeah, that's, <laughs> we might just get white before then. Well, well what is the, the actual critical path? 
Uh, you're supposed to do the gym here. Okay, so we're gonna do the gym. Come on, come on. Also, I leveled everything to like the. Er, yeah. Five. I also leveled everything to like the the max possible level for the gym. So. Fighting is super effective against rock type. Yeah, remember we got this last time, and then like I sent I sent him in against the. I leveled him up and sent him in against the fucking Geo dude, and then he got self-destructed uh, immediately. Now was, was the like, the fat boy went like, down to Geo dude. Uh, yeah. I was just like, all right. These these guys get the premier balls because they're the only chance that this run has. I, I don't know, man. That Ammonite, like. That's what I'm saying. He gets one too. He got he got a premier ball. All right. And Makuhita, they're they're the saviors of the 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 run lives or dies on them now. All right. So HP and attack is uh, this guy's better attributes. Yeah. Um, He's super slow though. Let's see what the Pokedex has to say about this gentleman. It toughens its body by slamming into thick trees. Oh, <laughs> I, was, I, was, yeah, I wasn't reading the one you have. I have like a list. Uh, uh, I think we called the other one Tubbs, right? Yeah, we sure did. Uh, I'm going to name this one Chonk. Let's call him Chonky. Chonky. I'm trying to like, I was that a special Pokedex entry made for Kaizo? Because no, I don't. No, it's just it gets it gets updated. I would assume. Yeah. Well, uh, I'm, you're probably looking at the at the more recent game, uh, the more whatever games. Well, no, like, it, it's uh, I'm looking at the the site that like tells you the entry for like every game. Uh, uh all right. We need to pump them up. We are hard stuck though in the fact that uh on the fact that we've got five pokemon but four of them are very good against this gym and one of them is very not mm. but remember they have fucking like weird specific pokemon designated to counter the the gym counters Like, remember that a lot of their shit has Giga Drain, so, like, Ammonite is pretty vulnerable to that. Yeah. Forest Bomb, nice. Alright. Then when we get over there, we'll go over how we're treating the, the gems and the leveling and stuff. Because we kind of like changed how we were doing it. That's fine. V vital throw. Powerful against paralyzed foe, but also heals them. Sand attack. Force palm. Vital throw. Never misses, but moves last. Okay. Chonky's got a solid move set. I ain't gonna lie. He, all of his moves are sixty base. And a nice. Lot of them can't miss. Nice. How about we give uh, some of these guys berries, too? I don't know if... I don't think Ammonite can fucking survive a self-destruct. Yeah. I think we have to sack somebody. Yeah, because even though he is Rock-type and it would be not very effective, it might just still blow him out the water. I mean, we could try... He just... It looks like he has a low HP pool. Maybe it's just because, like... Chonky has such a high HP pool. Well, let's check it out real quick. So he has Swift Spin, which... Sucks. Kind of sucks, yeah. What does Sunflora have? Oh, yeah. Speed and Sunshine. The one that also sucks. Then he's got Heat and Cold Protection. What the fuck does that mean? He just takes half damage from... I have no idea what thick fat does. I don't think it's going to help us in this rock gym. Google it, Google it real quick so we know. Okay. Well, uh, I hope I don't get sent to some sketchy site when I type in Pokemon uh, thick fat. 
Yo, how's it going? I'm a fucking liar. I'm gonna tell you that this Pokemon's only rock stuff, but it's a fucking lie. You're gonna die. Thanks. Okay. If a Pokemon with thick fat is attacked by an ice or fire type move, the opponent's attack or special attack is reduced by 50% during the da damage calculation. All right, so it takes half damage. From ice or fire, which actually isn't bad. It's okay. All right. Let's see, um, Omanite. Let's see, God, can you take this self destruct? Oh my God, this is sus of receipt. I hate this kid. I do too. Dude. Fuck you, Josh. Oh, yeah, we didn't explain. So let's explain real fast. So, what we're doing going forward, because we're going in blind and there's a lot of cheesy shit that goes on. So cheesy. We're, we're leveling our team to the max level um, of the. We're leveling them to the max level of the strongest Pokemon of the gym leader before going into the gym. But then we don't really care about, like, if it over levels against the trainers in the gym. Because we're bad at Pokemon. And so this game's bullshit, dude. This game's such bullshit. Get, that get, him. get him. Kill this dude. Kill him. Oh. oh, God, dude. Never doubted him for a second. Except for that one second I doubted him. Yeah, fuck you, Zubat. This one's got the Mega Drain. Flying Poison. Some. Yes, Flying Poison. Oh, and also we have Aura oh, Beam. Aura Beam. Uh, ice is dun, 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 double checking. Uh, it is very super effective against flying. Yes. 100%. My only concern is that if it doesn't kill him, then he gets a Giga Drain off. God might be dead. But we might freeze him. Do it. He gets a Giga oh, Drain okay. off first. It's been an honor, God. Oh, he lived. God had his energy drained. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, fuck you, Zubat. Bring down the whole system, God. Sudowoodo? He's a rock type. Oh, you're risking it, dude? Hell yeah, dude. God's stronger than this guy. I knew he was faster. Holy hell. <laughs> that tree was just like, what the fuck? <laughs> 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 What's that fucking God? Here's another Ammonite. Oh, no. Don't risk it, dude. No, 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 some floor is coming out for this one. Hell it yeah. It probably has Aurora Beam, but some floor will be 4x or four X effective with their Mega Drain. Omanite's oh, looking at a Sunflower. He's just like, my natural enemy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I knew it had Aurora Beam. Please don't one shot. Please don't one shot. All right, actually, that was not nearly as bad. Yeah, we're going to get like our our Omanite hit way harder. Oh yeah. Fuck. <laughs> fuck you, Josh. Yeah, what now, you, Josh? <laughs> You've got the worst name and the worst team. How's it feel? You're just too good for me. Yes, yeah, that's fucking right, dude. <laughs> All right. All right. I don't know much about the next guy. I know he had a dragonfly, but that was about it. We lost to the next guy. Yeah. We wiped on the next guy. I, I can't remember what it was, though. I mean, we just lead with God, right? Like, yeah. <laughs> that's that's the solution for this gym. Just lead with God. Fuck like, you, Josh. Yo, I'm not gonna lie. Our our Ammonite hit really fucking hard. Dude. You imagine that uh, special attack, dude. You imagine if he uh, if he learns a fucking rainstorm or whatever the the weather move is, and we could start making uh, use of yeah. his passive. Ideally, we wouldn't want him to have that move. Ideally, we would want some kind of water Pokemon that just has that has that whenever they swap in. That's true. And so you lead with them, and then you swap them out and to get into them. <laughs> Did right? you see me fuck Josh up? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck's this little is this, school? Is this? I don't. I don't think she is the one that we wiped to. No, I think, it was, I think it was the old guy. Yeah, Aaron. A A Ron. Oh no, it was the Ammonite. We didn't make it past the Ammonite, right? Yeah, Ammonite's a beast. Uh, A A Ron. So this is metal, like metal rock. He's steel rock, yes, and his highest attribute is defense. Is steel? I know steel is weak to 
ground, I believe. Hold right? on, let me figure out. Steel. Yeah. I don't know if I should hit it with ground, ice, or... Steel water. is weak to fire, fighting, ground, and acid. Okay, so Mudshot should be 4x effective. You wanna fuck with God? <laughs> Get wrecked. Slowed him down. He knows Thunderbolt. Oh, he does no brick break, though. Oh, no! Oh, no. Blah, 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 Fucking take that! Yeah! Yes, just power level <laughs> god. One shot everybody. A Yami! Oh, I can ice beam him. Aurora beam him. Oh my- oh, it's been an honor god. He's faster at level 11 and has Giga Drain. No! Ouch. It's been an honor, dude. No! All right. Well, we know that for next time. Um, Bug flying. I think we gotta go board here. Yeah, because a peck will still be super effective. How's... Oh my god, it has speed boost. This is the end, brother. Peck How's uh, Psychic's not good against Bug, right? Uh, oh, it has ancient power. Oh yeah, that's right. Uh, bug, bug, bug. Uh, fire is good against bug, and flying is good against bug, and rock. That's it. Fucking send out the flower! This is a problem. This guy's a problem. He probably has some kind of flying move, too. Probably. Just fucking dragonfly. Yeah, there it is. Ow. Get him! I think we're dead to this Anma. Uh, actually, like, realistically. No. <laughs> Speed boost is off the fucking chain, dude. We're, we gotta sack, we gotta sack some flora. Unfortunate. But I can't fucking swap into anybody here. So that move is going to be super effective against Makuhita. Giga, or Giga Drain's going to fuck Krabby. And the Ancient Power is going to fuck Bored. So you I just, think we're just, you just got to throw people out there. Alright, go Chonky. It's unfortunate. That speed boost. Oh, that is that's fucking rough. No, uh, no, no, no. I guess faint, right? Faint attack. You but, said fighting is not very effective. So yeah. Yeah, faint attacks the only thing I can do here. Or smelling salt, but. No. It has aerial ace too. And a critical. Oh no. God, bro. That's big yikes. What a strong bug. Yeah, what a crazy. All right, well, we made it one trainer further. Oh, get get him with the metal claw. I think aerial ace is better, right? Because that's just super yeah. effective. Yeah, you're right. But no. <gasps> Crabby, I doubted you. No. Damn, but he has three more Pokemon. <laughs> Fucking bubble beam him. Get him, Krabby. Fucking do it, Krabby. Dude, is Krabby gonna be the hero that we need? Uh. Metal Claw, I guess. Right? Yeah. Like... Waka. That was a crit. That was very, very uh, underwhelming. Yeah. Oh no! This is the end of Krabby. Yeah. Oh wow! That one speed speed drop made that difference. That was not very effective. Krabby, no. Uh oh. He's gonna get frozen, dude. Not if he one shots with side beam. Get him. Confuse that rock. Uh -oh. oh my god, that was nowhere near one-shotting. Is this the moment? 
Is this the moment? No. 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 Oh. Ah. Oh. That is it. We are out on this run. We got wiped by a dragonfly. No. Dude. I would if if I had any fucking inkling that I could have one shot him. Although that was a crit with the aerial ace, but yeah, that's all unlucky shit. No. All right, we gotta remember that Yanma for the next run. Yeah, but what the fuck problem. are we gonna do about him? Because he he has a rock move too. What the fuck do we do? Yeah, but like that would have been a great Mareep kill. Yeah, that's true. But then he would have got a dog. Um, but the issue would be that when it uses secret power it does this, the the rock type and it's going to one shot it all right hey we look are... we're back we're back <laughs> we are back all right fucking what do, i don't know what i'm supposed to do right now i don't know if i gotta run down let me see i don't think oh, so no, th i probably just got the oh, wait i have my running shoes already so yeah, I think we are catching Pokemon right now. Do I have the Pokemon already? Yeah. Oh yeah, all right, neat. Yeah, so we that's where it's safe. Oh, I don't have the rare candies though. I guess I should do... Oh wait, yeah, I do have the rare candies. Nice. Dang, look at me preparing for the future. Hey, look, Spliff's what? alive again. Hooray, Spliff is back. Dude, Spliff is immortal. Uh, which patch of bush, which patch of grass here do we do? Um, go to the left. Left, all right. Let's see what we get. Come on, Togepi. Doom, 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 doom. Warmple. Okay, that's it, an option, I guess. It's a Warmple. I right, just fucking eat a Pokeball. Doom, 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 doom. Hell yeah. All right. What are we gonna call this Warmple? Uh, I can't remember. It turns into like a fucking moth. Uh, yeah, that or a butterfly. Beauty fly or dust ox. Dust we'll ox. Call him dusty. We're gonna call him Dusty. And then if he, he'll be really confused if he turns into a butterfly. <laughs> Let's see what the Pokedex has to say about Wurmple. It lives amidst tall grass and in forest. When attacked, it resists by playing its venomous spikes at the foe. Wow. It's a oh, hey! It's a ladybug! It's a bug! At least there's our flying type right there. Oh no, is this gonna kill me before I catch it? Oh god! Oh Frank. no! <laughs> you gotta just throw a Pokeball at him. Fucking yeet! Oh, <laughs> bye bye, Spliff. Okay, well now Dusty has to come out, right? We throw another one. This is our new starter. If we catch it. If not, the run's over already. Alright, we got it. Hey, we Wendy got it. our new starter. Farewell, Spliff. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Uh, this we will call this Spliff. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alright. Alright, that was uh Let's see what the Pokedex has to say. Um uh, it is so timid, it can't move if it isn't with a swarm of others. It conveys its feelings with scent. I don't know about that. That thing just fucking murdered that Trico by itself pretty readily. <laughs> ah, yes. Trico. <laughs> what a wonderful start. We're a bug trainer now, all right? Yeah, that, we're, that's how we defeat the rock gym. <laughs> this might be exactly. <laughs> we should be a bug trainer. I like wearing shorts, even in the winter. All right, uh, give, give those guys a couple levels. <laughs> yeah. 
I mean, we're in we're in a lot of danger right now because uh, the fire bush or whatever. Yeah. Although we could we can fish up the the first encounter, the fucking rimmer raid or the tentacle. <laughs> Dusty. I'm calling Dust Ox as the evolution. Let's see. That's my called shot. Yeah, I think that's Dust Ox. Silicoon. Oh. Uh, well, they're always Silcoon, but it's it's based on like the eye. Oh no, wait, it's not always Silcoon. It's Silcoon or Cascoon. Yeah, Cascoon turns into Dust Sauce. It's going to turn into a Beauty Fly. Oh, uh, Big Sag. It's just it. They evolve based on their personality, I guess. Uh, All right, a Silicoon. Let's see. Catch the water. Hopefully, we get a Tentacool. That'd be dope. All right. So a uh, oh. Silicoon. The Pokedex says having. Wrap silk around the branches of a tree, it quincessently waits to evolve? I don't know how to say that word. That's too big of a word for Pokemon. It's a kid's game. Come yeah, on. what the fuck? Filled with murder and fucking suicide bombers. <laughs> the, the pine cones and the geodudes. Yeah. Ah, uh, fucking Remoraid, man. I fucking hate Rim Raid. Because he always has that same ability that's just like absolute trash. He looks so stupid. Oh god. I'm trying to speed through this a little bit. It's not a speeding well. It is not. Oh god. Hey, he was that caught. Was a little fucking dangerous. What are you gonna call this, uh, Remoraid? Dumb. Hmm. The Pokedex says it has superb accuracy. The water it shoots can strike even a moving prey from more than a hundred yards away. I like how it says that, but then it always has the ability that it trades accuracy for power. <laughs> Look, it trades accuracy for power. Superb accuracy. I don't know, Mike. This Pokedex, it's like, is yeah. pretty official. Awakens quickly from sleep and heals the body by... Well, yeah, that's, that's, that's the one that it always is. Alright. Let's watch Dumb die. To a fire type. Well, you could uh, you could boost him up to level eight, so he doesn't die. die. Okay. All Hates right, face. Mike. What I happened? What, what about the uh, octopus? Don't you like the octopus? Uh, He'll never make it to being an octopus. <laughs> He'll never make it to an octopus. We only play with baby Pokemon here. Little and itty bitty bake up <laughs> some flowers, yeah. Come on, Growlithe. Do, do, do. Oh, is it? I think of picks. It still might know Roar, though. Yeah, it probably does. Just stay in your fucking ball. Huh? Stay in your fucking ball. No! Okay, Amber. So we get a second shot. I wonder if it gets caught with a Firestone. I doubt it. Quick attack. No. That's kind of like Roar, but with less Roars. Stay in your ball is your new home. Maybe it doesn't know Roar. <laughs> I don't think so. Uh-oh. That was uh, some pretty hefty damage. He was caught! 
What do you call Vulpix? Hmm. Call him Brock. That's Brock's Pokemon. In honor of the fact that this will die in a rock gym. Oh, okay. I, I see where it's getting uh, the Pokedex theme from. All right, Vulpix. It could freely control fire, making fiery orbs fly like Will-O-Wisp. Just before evolution, its six tails grow hot as if on fire. Wow, it's, it's, not, it's like it's a fire type or something. It's that thing! You don't get a premier ball gulping. You get a I'm sorry that I have to catch you ball. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Call him. Ah. Uh. What do you think? He looks. I don't. I don't know. I, I don't. I. I can't get like a feel for this Pokemon. All it is is a stomach, and that's <laughs> literally all it is. Yeah. He's. Zzz. See what the Pokedex has to say. Oh, we need to heal before we do this, because this might be the fucking shark thing. Glumpin. This Pokemon stomach fluid can even digest iron. Ooh. In one gulp, it could swallow something as large as itself. Come on, carnivore. Yeah. No <laughs> I'm a fish. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's a dark type. All right. That's a problem. Alright, we just eat Pokeballs and pray. Oh, uh, yeah, Pokemon might die. Oh, you got it! Hmm. Chum. Chum. Let's see. Carnava, whatever. Chum attacks. Carvana. <laughs> yeah. Chum attacks ships in swarms, making them sink. Although it is said to be a very vicious Pokemon, it timidly flees as soon as it finds itself alone. Just like Ladybug. They're like the same Pokemon. Except one sinks people's ships. I don't know, man. If a swarm of ladybug, like, mug people, that's kind of scary. They just come in and get, like, punched in the face. Like, each, each one has, like, five, six boxing gloves. <laughs> it's like, boom, 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 boom. Eight. Get everybody to eight. Da, 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 da. Ah, yes. Who needs a starter Pokemon? Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. Whoops. All right. Now let's take a look at it, ready? Before we go to our first battle. Yeah, we know you suck. Yeah, we know that one. Know that one. Raises fo Oh, he's got pressure. Raises their PP usage. That's good, maybe. Prevents item theft. It's okay. Rough skin hurts to touch. That's pretty good. So anytime he takes a physical hit, he will all they'll do damage to themselves. Good. It's time for our first Pokemon battle. Yes, against sir. this fucking punk. Who's gonna take uh, the lead? Our starter, dude. <laughs> yeah, this <laughs> this is my starter Pokemon. I got it from the professor. Um, you sure? <laughs> yeah, certainly. It's just a fucking bug. <laughs> <laughs> it's a caterpillar you found outside. Ah, uh, yes. Fucking aerial ace right out the gate. Just... Oh, 
Damn, man. Stupid fucking oh, fuck raccoon. Smooth. I actually don't know the... I should have looked at the damage values of these. Silverwind. Yes, yeah, yeah. Silverwind is a really weird one because it is a bug type. Both 60. This one... Oh, Air Release always hits? I didn't know that. That may raise abilities. Yeah, this one can boost you. Oh, and the PP is only 5. It must be really good. I mean, it's it does 60. Both of his attacks do 60 damage. He, he fucking claps right now. But Aerial Ace is just awesome because, like, sand attack doesn't matter. That dude's berry juice didn't matter either. Oh god, it's a fucking dog. Watch out. I think we could take an ember, though. Uh, if do you think it. it has ember? Oh, you're right. It's not a fire type. It's just a dart. Yeah, it's just a dog. Yeah, it's just gonna bite. And I can... Bug doesn't affect dark types, is that it? Or... No, bug should be fine. Let's see, bug versus dark... Um, bug is actually super effective against Dark. No, yeah, yep, yep, yep. Nope, oh, I, missed. I missed. Yeah, I'm not too sure why Bug's super effective against Dark, but that's what it says. <laughs> He's just oh, like, oh good. man, my brooding fucking bugs. <laughs> I can't brood when there's bugs all over me. Dude, Ladybug is a way stronger starter than Trico, not gonna lie. Make us proud. Ladybug's just gonna sweep through everything until we get to... Until we get to, like, the gym, and then he'll die a horrible death. Yeah, for being blood fine type. It's just like, what are you doing here? <laughs> I'm here to have fun. Uh, no. <laughs> you don't get to have fun. This is competitive. Oh god, what's happening? Kinda speeding through a lot, just cause, uh... Aerial Ace, get fucked. Aha, I take that Caterpie. Damn, man, he's gonna sweep him. Yeah, I think he will. I mean, that Kakuna ain't gonna slow his roll. Oh, it survived. <laughs> Iron defense. It's the only fucking move I got. Is that a full heal? Yes. Wow. Hell yeah. Sorry. We finished him off anyway. Fucking get it, Spliff. Oh no. Nah. Right. Automatic confusion. Pretty good. Let me look up something. Play. When does Ladybug evolve at level 18? Oh man, it keeps boosting his defense. What are you gonna do? The same thing I've done every <laughs> move. Yeah. Noise. Didn't even take damage that fight. Dun, dun, dun. Thanks, chump. Get the berries, yeah. I forgot to put berries on people at the gym battle. That might have actually helped. This is the metronomy spam thing. Dude, I'm pretty sure this ladybug is gonna hit like level 14 just by steamrolling these trainers. But um. Hmm, yeah. Come on, get that stat boost. Yeah. Oh, oh that's the good stuff, too. Damn, oh, man. Yeah. Super effective. Boom. One shot. Oh my god, it did so much damage. Give me another stat boost. Sorry, just fucking sweep your team. 
Hell yeah. Where was that oh, critical gosh. before? Oh, actually, both of those are super effective. I'm just gonna keep spamming the silver wind to get the stat boost. Hell yeah. What now, you acorn? What now? Oh god. <gasps> no explosion. Don't do it. Uh okay. <laughs> Can't um, use ground on me. Oh god, no more PP. Don't do it, Tokopi. Fisher. Uh what the hell is tail glow? What are you doing, Tokopi? That's kinda scary. I mean, he's just dead, though. Who the fuck knows Tail Glow naturally? I have no idea. Fuck you, Tiana. Let's go fucking heal, yeah. Damn, man, I can't believe Spliff got replaced by Spliff and we're all the better for it. We are. Ladybug pretty strong though, not gonna lie. Dun, 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 right dun, 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 Just has a really good move set right out the gate. The Silver Wind and Aerial Ace, like. And now it has auto confusion too for the extended fights. Yes, your level seven bug will handle my level eleven bug well. It's dead. Oh my god, it lived. That's impressive. Of course. Dude, always. It's 100% poison when used by CPUs. Ah. Aerial Ace, get it, get it. Damn, these Pokemon got some defense. Uh oh. Uh, yeah, Brock. Get him, Brock. Alright. Metapod. Just set it on fire till it dies. Alright. Wow, super interesting. Do you have an antidote? I don't think so. But potions are way cheaper than antidotes, I think. Ah! Be careful about the fast forwarding. Remember, it always fucks you up. It'll fuck us over by being Mr. Fast Travel Man. I'm only trying to fast forward, uh... I'm only trying to fast forward some of the encounters, to be honest. Like the ones that are kind of safe, but yeah, I'm definitely... I'm just trying to get us back to where we were, because... I'm sure people don't want to just watch the same part. Apparently they do. That's some people stream the same <laughs> shit over and over. <laughs> true, true. All right, let's get the water type. Come on, Toto Dial. You're one of my favorites. Squirtle. Oh my god. This yeah, guy, another man. bug for the team. Hooray. We need more bugs. I wanted to kill it just like out of spite, but like we might fucking need it at some point. This is a problem. At least he's hurting himself now. There we go. He got caught. Oh my god. You couldn't even get into Pokemon Center, dude. <laughs> I, did, I took a victory line. That's all it was. 
All right. Uh, oh yeah, this guy. Let's see what Sun the Pokedex has to say about Sunscorn. They gather on puddles after evening downpours, gliding across the surface of the water as if sliding. It secretes honey with a sweet aroma from its head. Why? To attract stuff. I don't know. Why don't you attract? Why don't you secrete honey from your head? I don't know. New Pokemon. Oh! It's a Nidoran! Of course it missed. And of course it's poison. It got caught! Are you gonna call this guy? Mc Honor of Jon Snow. McQueen. McQueen. Let's see. Nidoran. The Pokedex says uh, its highly toxic barbs are thought to be developed as protection for this small bodied Pokemon. When enraged, it releases a horrible toxin from its horn. Sounds like a lot of Pokemon so far. You definitely want to pull her out. So who do we ditch? Probably dumb. Raid. Yeah, get dumb out. Yeah. Uh. Okay. I don't want either of those other two on the team. So check the the passive of Surskun. It might be really good. It's trash. You don't know. Oh, it is. Rain. It is bad. We should look at the Nidoran, too. Poison's froze on contact. Yeah, poison point. I'd much rather have that. Do, 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 do. Alright, let's check this next fight. This is the fight of the flying guy, so. Who's in the, the top slot? Not Spliff. Uh, flyers. We don't really have a good anti-flyer kind of. I guess let's just throw in Chum. Chum would be probably all right. Uh, and I'll, I'll level everybody up once because I don't remember what level these, these guys are. Get them to level nine. Ooh, bite attack. Do, 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 do. Oh, that's a that's an awkward one to see on a gulping, I guess. There's war. <laughs> All right. Do, 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 do. There's Don't do it. That's that's ground. It'll be ground probably because it's on the beach. Hell yeah, bite it. Fuck you, bird. How you think that's gonna do anything? One shots. <laughs> Hell yeah. I'm speed tied with him, interesting. Yeah, bro, man, it's a fish, he's quick. As you know what, he does turn into Sharpedo, so I guess that makes sense. Fuck you, bird! Uh oh, that's dangerous. The nine fucking damage. Get him out of there. Pursuit. Uh, maybe. I'm a stomach. Ugh. This is super effective. That's alright. It's just like five damage. Get him with your fire punch. <laughs> uh oh. Little did you expect. Is that accuracy? Yeah, that's accuracy. 
Oh, damn. Boom. Damn, that fire punch. To be honest, this team's kind of solid. I ain't gonna lie. I think this we is... We have some very glaring weaknesses, though, right now. Yeah, we just need more Pokemon. Right now, we have, like, very little coverage against types. Like, for instance, like, flying. Like, we had no super affecting, effective against that guy. We just beat him because fish go chomp. Like... That's all we need. But yeah, we're we're around the time on this particular episode as well. Uh, we got one more, two more, I think. If you want to do that, if you wanted to leave off at the in front of the what's it called, the town thing or the uh, forest. Do you think you could beat these guys in ten minutes? Uh, I could probably beat them in like five. All right, we'll go for it. This is going to be the most dangerous guy right here for right now, because we just don't have any kind of, like, electric coverage or anything. Hey, get that stat shit up. Uh-oh. Yeah. Yeah, it's super effective. Oh, and a, a crit. crit. Of course. Unfortunate. Oh, you got poison point, dude, for it. Oh no, that's okay. That's, that wasn't too bad as far as damage goes. We would get crit one shot though. This one has Aurora Beam. Uh, which is a problem. A bite. Bite. Oh my god, he's dead. Rain continues to fall. Oh, use dive. That seems like an awkward choice against a fish. Oh, it's still oh a crit for a bunch of damage though. Secret power. <laughs> it's dead. You were right though. That was a mud shot that it just used. So that was definitely ground. Do 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 do. Love this. This one just spams water pulse, if I remember correctly. Maybe. I think I'm okay as long as I don't get crit. You always say that, and you always lose Pokemon. Oh, it's using dive. I guess the question is, who do we want to try and take this dive? Because... Uh, the stomach. Acid. No, oh, no. Did I miss that yawn? I, I think so. Die. You're going too fast, Mike. This is unfortunate, my friend. Damn. That's toxic, dude. Do, 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 do. I don't think I can take this because I think the toxic will kill with the damage. Dude, I'm, either way, somebody's dead. This is unfortunate. I just got the poison off. Let's bring you out so you pressure and make him use more PP for that. And then we. Swap in chum to eat the dive. Oh god. And you get rough skinned and then you get poisoned. Then maybe bite? Yeah, alright. That was a very tough fight. Who'd you lose? Did we, lose? we lost Spliff, that's alright. Well, the. To be fair, we lost split split to some bullshit right there, but the uh, the crit <laughs> super effective bounce. It's just like uh... oh, wrong thing. We got eleven more steps. Two, three, four. Yeah, we're good. Well, yeah. No, I'm not. We you need to dump him, dump the body. Unfortunate. Farewell, spliff. All right. Other spliff. 
All right, well, I guess we'll, we'll catch everyone next time and we'll see if we could uh, get back to where we started for like the seventh time <laughs> later. Hello there. I'm Professor Nuzlocke. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. This world is inhabited far and wide by all different types of Pokemon. For some people, Pokemon are pets. Others use them for battle. Now, a very tragic Pokemon legend is about to unfold. A world of torment, of grief, and adventure with Pokemon awaits. Let's go.